you now have the option to get an AI warning sticker. Check it out. Okay, so it's not a sticker, but it is a browser extension. Now you can implement this motherfucker on Google Chrome or Firefox, man. So let's go ahead and get into it. Like it says right here. Available on both Firefox and Google Chrome, the AI wanted for Steam extension highlights any game that uses generative AI. Its description reads, if a Steam store page contains an AI-generated content disclosure, this extension will display it as a model pop-up instead of just at the end of the page. Additionally, it will blur out the rest of the page until the pop-up is dismissed. Of course, it means browsing Steam through your web browser rather than the platforms native app but it's a small price to pay if you plan to give ai games a wide berth and it can help you make your decision about whether to buy a game or not far easier and this is pretty cool they gave a con if you were to download this browser extension like it says right here if you do use the extension expect the warning to pop up a lot in july it was reported that 20 percent of the games released up until that point had used generative ai and it's only going to get worse as companies invest more in the tech they're becoming more brazen with its usage and we're really starting to see that now with the big h2 game Games like Black Ops 7, Where Wins Meet, and Ark Raiders all adopting it. And I talked about it before in my last video. I really do think it's going to be a downhill spiral from here with AI being implemented to, to create these games. You understand what I'm saying? Because it's definitely going to make the companies lazy and it's going to streamline basically the same shit that they've had before. Basically a copy and paste method, but at a faster rate. And we don't want to see that, man. We want to see passion and new ideas and innovation behind these games. So until they can figure out how to do this shit with AI, man, we do not want to see AI being made without video games at all but you know maybe i'm just speaking for myself and then this is also good to see as well like it says right here in the last paragraph thankfully while many major companies are beginning to rely on ai others are starting to shun it the witcher 3's director stated that games won't have soul if they're made solely with ai like i said earlier and larian's head of publishing spoke out about square enix laying off qa workers and replacing them with ai tools the creative director at ad hoc studio creators one of 2025's biggest gems dispatch also slammed the tools saying they're only creative if you aren't creative yourself taking shots at these motherfuckers man so we definitely want to see shit like this man some people are fucking with it which is more so these greedy ass companies and a lot of people are not fucking with it you understand what i'm saying but you let me know in the comments how do you feel about video games being made with generative ai